But anyway, we're starting out a whole new week. Yeah, we are. And, um, you know, we just came out of a week that was, uh, well, for some, you know, uh, it wasn't all that great. It was heartbreaking. And for others, as, uh, you know, when I did my devotional thing, I wished everybody a terrific Tuesday. Now, it was Tuesday afternoon when um, Bill Melton passed away. And for those who loved him and knew him and who's got a big hole in their heart from his absence, as we'll all miss him, um, it, it was a terrible Tuesday. There wasn't anything terrific about it. But you know, I believe... That for Bill, I believe it was a terrific Tuesday. I do. I do. Because Tuesday afternoon, Bill was able to leave all his worries and cares and body failures and struggles to try to keep enjoying life and giving it all he had for the love of it. He got to leave this old earthly uh, holding tank that our spirits dwell in. And he was released into freedom and complete health once again. And I, I, I think Bill was rejoicing. Because, uh, you know, in 2 Corinthians in chapter 5, um, it says that when we're absent from the body, we're present with the Lord. And you know, it's the book of Ecclesiastes, the third chapter. You know, it, it tells us there is a time for everything and a season for every activity under heaven. And in the very second verse, it says, there's a time to be born and a time to die. You know, it's every one of us spirits are going to be placed in these earthly bodies and they're going to wear out and then the day is going to come when we've completed our mission here on earth and I do believe Bill you know he brought the message of telling people you love them have no regrets and you know if if you watch the last few videos he did, there's a peacefulness about him, man. And the words that have been set, said throughout the tributes, I've tried to watch all the tributes, you know, Bill touched hearts. Yeah, he did. And uh, Bill knew where he was going. He knew who held his life in their hands. I'm doing good now. You know, I love y'all. And that's what I got. And I'll give y'all more more when I know more. But all I can say is, it's okay. I'm doing okay. Don't stress. I love you. And you know, we ain't promised tomorrow. This is good proof. To kill somebody, you love them, you know. Don't have no regrets. I love y'all. Tell somebody you love them. This package is from Fab Creations. A surprise to me at that. Um, and when I opened the mailbox and it was there, all I could remember was Bruce's story. And it moved me to tears. And I know uh, the, the girl that was with me is like, okay, you get a package in the mail and you got tears, you know. But it did. It, it, um, thinking of Bill and also thinking of Bruce and the kind hearts of so many in the community and the way they touch lives and, and the way that that mine's touched. And I have I really I have no clue what's in here. You know, not really. I don't. Um, I know. 
Bruce had asked me, I don't remember when it was, about stickers. He wanted to get stickers. And he promised me I would get some of the first ones uh, that went out. And this is far more than a sticker. So, Bruce, I have no clue what's in here. You know, when I think about it, it couldn't have came at a at a, a better time. Um, because I do believe that there's a time to every season. And I think when our hearts are moved, by no matter what, I think that's a part of God showing us, you know, reminding us of his love, of our love we're to have for others, of the love others have that share it, and Bill's message, you know, tell someone you love them, because tomorrow is not promised, you know, and I know that, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna see what's in this, in this box, Use my little cheapy uh, Wartec. It's just a Wartec. I mean, it's a nice knife. And I think I paid three or four bucks for it. I don't know. Anyway, Bruce, buddy, I have no idea what's in here. But uh, I'll tell you this right now. <sighs> yeah, I've... <laughs> It's brought, it's brought some tears, and even just trying to send Bruce a message that I received it, and trying to type it out, had me choked up and, and tears welling up in my eyes, and so, you know. Oh, gosh. Bruce. Oh my gosh. This is so cool. I have admired them from afar. Um You are so kind. So kind. Oh my gosh. He had already had an envelope. It, 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 something, and it is unexpected. I mean, no way. Oh man. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Yep. Here it is, guys. <laughs> Made in the USA. Oh, yeah. Check it out. Fabrications. Yeah. Fab creations. What did I say? Fabrications. Oh, my gosh. Bruce, this is awesome, buddy. That is so awesome. I mean, so awesome. Oh, and there's more. These are so cool. And I am so honored. I really am. I mean, oh. Bruce, I was honored to get to help with them. Um, I really was. And this, oh my gosh, I can't wait, I can't wait, oh my gosh, I got a manger, oh, how cool, how cool, look at how, look at the little inn for dream creations and adventures, fab. Creations. 
13. What's the 13? Uh, Bruce, help me out. I, I am totally flabbergasted, man. This is so cool. These are just so awesome. And totally unexpected. Oh, my gosh. You know, I don't care. The greatest value, the great, not value, the greatest treasure. No, that's not what I'm trying to say either. The most valuable thing we can have in life is love, compassion, and care for one another. I got a manger. I got a manger. It is fabulous. Fab creations. Whew, I know it's getting long. I've rambled on. I'm going to be firing it up. All right. Bruce, thanks once again, man. Uh, let me tell you, I really appreciate the notes. I treasure the notes. I treasure it all. I treasure your friendship. You know, I treasure all you guys, man. I really do. Um, that's the thing that keeps me on the tubes is, you know, you, you can connect with with good people. With lights that give a bright light to, um, to the path ahead of you. Y'all have a wonderful week ahead. Um... Know that my prayers are with all of you, each and every one of you. Uh, a lot of things going on, a lot of struggles. But you know what? We're going to get them one by one. Yeah, we are. Hang in there with one another. God bless y'all. Thanks again, Bruce. Whoa, I can't. I just, I, I'm going to have to fire it up. I'm going to have to fire it up.